Hey everyone, so welcome back to another tutorial and today I'm going to show you how you can uh, generate a free SSL certificate for your GoDaddy domain uh, and this tutorial is for GoDaddy managed hosting. Uh, so if you if you are using word uh, GoDaddy's WordPress managed hosting and um, you have a domain connected to that and you bought the lowest plan uh, the entry level plan which do not offer the free SSL certificate uh, even though I recommend the not the entry level plan which do not have uh, SSL certificate for the specific reason uh, but uh, but if you have already done that then I will provide you a solution how you can install a free SSL certificate uh, without buying uh, the SSL certificate from GoDaddy and for this we will be using Cloudflare okay so all you have to do is follow step by step instructions and I will quickly show you how to do it okay so first go to this uh, url dash dot cloudflare dot com and i will provide a link in the description if you want or you can just go to google and go to cloudflare website and then go to sign up this is the sign up link and i have already shown this in my previous tutorial how to sign up for cloudflare the link will be in the description also but it's very simple all you have to do is provide your email address create uh, create a password and then click on create account and once you have done that in your gmail you will get an email for verification just follow that link and you will your cloudflare account will be created and once you have done that what you have to do is go to log into your cloudflare account so i will show you how right now how to log in just log in simply and your username password and then click on login okay once you have logged into your cloudflare account you will see this option of adding a website as you can see right now there are no website connected to my cloudflare account okay so now let's go back to the godaddy dashboard okay go to godaddy website and log into your account and here uh, in the drop down menu go to my products okay this will this page will show all the services connected to your godaddy account so you can see here this is my domain this is my managed wordpress hosting and uh, an email account email service i have so what we need to do is uh, select the correct domain if you have multiple domains uh, connected to your godaddy account select the correct domain and click on dns Once you click on DNS, uh, this domain man DNS management page will open. All you have to do is scroll down and here you will see this options of updating name servers. So now let's add this domain to Cloudflare. Um, this is my domain. So I will simply copy and go to Cloudflare and click on add site. Here enter my domain and then click on add site okay now this process will take 24 uh, few hours to update uh, so here on the next page select the free plan and then click on confirm plan okay now cloudflare will scan your dns record uh, dns records and automatically uh, fill the required dns records and you do not have to modify anything here just simply click on continue okay and once you have done that you will see this page that log into your godaddy account remove this name servers and replace with cloudflare name servers so what you have to do is right now is copy click to copy and then go here scroll down and click on this change option And, uh, and then click on this option enter my name servers advanced and here enter copy paste the cloudflare name servers paste both cloudflare name servers here okay and once you have done that click on save okay so right now and once you have done that um, okay uh, what you will okay I, i'm not uh, right now changing my domain name servers so i will just all you have to do is click on save and once you have done that what you have to do is go to cloudflare again 
and click on done check name servers okay and now it will ask you to set up the security configuration so instead of full do not select full because we do not have a valid certificate on our web server uh, for our domain so select the uh, second option flexible okay click on this select the flexible option so what it will do is it will uh, cloud it will use your cloudflare certificate to protect this uh, your customers or visitors traffic and all the traffic from your customers or visitors browser to cloudflare servers will be encrypted and from cloudflare to your origin server it will not be encrypted but that's not a big issue um, unless you are dealing with a WooCommerce kind of site uh, if you have an e-commerce kind of store I would recommend you to go uh, and buy a SSL certificate or the best option would be to not select the entry-level plan because uh, you will get better resources and a better deal so again scroll down and turn on this option always use HTTPS what it will do is redirect all non-secure traffic to the HTTPS version okay and leave all this option right now and then click on done okay now again it will show you this option that um, you can see here that registrars typically process name server update within 24 hours once this process complete cloudflare confirm your site activation via email so you do not have to continuously keep on uh, rechecking it manually if you want you can do that also but you do not have to do it absolutely um, but you can instead cloudflare will automatically keep checking the name server updation at regular intervals and once it detects the correct name servers it will automatically send you an email and once that is done what you have to do is go to your website uh, wordpress website best WP, like for me my website is bestwpguides.com slash login and log into your wordpress admin area okay i have set up a second factor authentication so i will enter that code here and click on val validate now this will log me into the wordpress dashboard area right now you can see it is not secure okay and make sure that once you get the confirmation email that your uh, name server update tip updating process is completed login then only log into the wordpress dashboard and you will be you know, try to access it over the https version you can see right now if i try to access it it will show an error okay so i'll just go back here and once it starts working on the secure version what you have to do is go to plugins click on add new so what we will do is we will use a plugin called simple ssl to redirect uh, to make sure that our website is only using the https version and not serving over the unsecured version okay so click on install now okay and then activate it okay right now you can see here that detected possible certificate issues uh, really uh, real really simple SSL plugin failed to detect a valid SSL certificate because currently the updating process has not completed okay so right now uh, once the process is complete you uh, you will not see this error and um, you can also check manually here that re by reloading over HTTPS okay and once it is done you will see an option to redirect all your HTTP traffic to HTTPS and this is just for um, you know uh, for a backup so to make sure that your website is serving the correct version and um, it's completely optional if your site works without this plugin it's fine completely you do not need to install this plugin but if you see any error like um, if even after using the HTTPS version you are seeing not secure here or anything like that um, 
okay so what you, you if you, it, it will show here that your site uh, connection to the site is not secure even if uh, using a uh, after using the cloudflare certificate uh, you can use this plugin and it will solve all your problem so this is just optional in case there's any error you see okay so i hope you found this tutorial useful and um, if you have any queries doubts or anything post in the comments and if this worked for you please post your feedback in the comments how you like this tutorial and any improvements you would like me to make and um, you know and also do consider giving a like to this video subscribe to my channel for more search wordpress related useful tutorials and there are very various tutorials on my website uh, youtube channel related to woocommerce and a uh, wordpress so you may find this find them useful do check out those videos too and to support a cha support my channel if you are going to buy any hosting or a new service uh, and if i have affiliate link you can use that you will get a better deal and you will not have to pay anything extra for it and you will, in the process you will also be supporting my channel and helping me in creating more useful content for everyone so guys uh, that's it for this video and i will see you in the next video